Hi traders, I just made over $5,000 day trading stocks in less than one hour. Let me show you how. SJM is my main candidate today, it's down 7%. I like the fact that it came down, then pulled back up, green candle as you can see here, and now coming down, I'm shorting. Shorted 4,000 shares. I need to see it under the lows, which is $98. And she comes, and she comes. Here we go, here we go. Oh, this is nice. Getting ready for my partial now. That was a quick $3,300. Case down 2%. Kellogg's stop is going to be over this consolidation here. I'm about to short 4,000 shares. Shorting now. Okay. Moving quickly. Looks nice. CONN is up 24%. I'm about to go long. 2,000 shares now. That's the first pullback. It's probably going to continue higher. Kellogg's is not doing so well. I'm just using a stop order in case it moves up just by a few cents. Oh, I'm out. I have a loser in Kellogg's. That's my first loser today, down $1,200. REVG is down 25%. I was looking for this pullback. It came down earlier without uh, without a pullback. Now it's about to pull back. I'm about to short, shorting now. 4,000 shares and she comes under the lows. CONN is bouncing a little bit. I'm just reducing my size here by 1,000 shares now. Well, it looked worse earlier. It looks better now. REVG came to my target. I shorted it earlier at 13.37. I'm about to cover at 13.04. Covering now 30 something cents. That was a nice REVG trade for $1,200. I like five. Five's up 20%. About to go long. Going long now, 2,000 shares. Like the momentum. CONN finally moved over the highs. I'm up like 40 cents, but earlier I lost 30 cents on my first uh, 300 shares selling now at a 40 cent gain. So end result of a loss and a win is $75. NXPI looks great over 122 really want to go long. I'm going to go long 2,000 shares. I think I'm going to buy it here at 122. Assuming it's going to go through very soon. LRCX has a very nice reversal mode here. I would like to short it soon. Uh, 17, yeah, here. 187.50 looked nice. I'm short. Five is looking good. I'm up now, but I was waiting for this breakout here, which didn't... Oh, now it's coming. Here we go. That's the breakout I was looking for. Look at this move over this very, very nice consolidation. I'm about to take my profits here. Selling now. Okay, great trade in five. Up more than three grand. LRCX came down. I shorted it earlier at 187.51. Taking now my partial a little bit less than one point with 1,000 shares. I'll take a look at the S&P 500. It's very important to understand gaps. Market started with a gap up today, came down, and right now closed the gap. At the point where it closes the gap, that's the point where it could reverse. The, the, this is a very important thing to notice. Look at yesterday. So always remember, if you have a trend of the S&P, S&P is coming down with a trend, it's worth nothing. It means nothing. It's probably going to stop and reverse. Is it going to continue trending lower? Possibly, but always suspect it's going to change direction and it can. I just asked my trading room member to mention how much they're making or losing. So look at the numbers here. These are the numbers of hundreds of traders who are trading live with me in the trading room every day. They can mirror my trades, they can follow me. In fact, they are providing me with their own picks too. So we all trade the same picks, we all discuss the same stocks. Every trade I take is posted here in the room and you can join us for a free 14-day trial if you just click here above. And here's how I'm doing today. I have uh, four winners, three losers, two of them are very small. End result, less than one hour, $5,700. Thank you for watching our video. Before you go, we invite you to join the TradeNet trading room for a free 14-day trial. TradeNet has educated more than 30,000 professional traders worldwide since 2004, and its trading room is one of the world's leading trading communities. Click here to start your free trial. 
If you like this video, please subscribe to our YouTube channel where you can view many more stock trading videos. Questions or comments, please submit them below.